closest to you, ladies and gentlemen, man's wrestled all over the world. I call him Mr. Wrestler. Meet Mr. Gene Kaniski. And a flying man in the trapeze. Look out. From Germany at 225 pounds, Mr. Eric Froelich. All-Star Wrestling. And we're happy to have you here at ringside. All right. Gene Kaniski versus Eric Froelich. The arm and collar elbow hold. The bell has went and it was running before you knew it. Gene Kaniski wrestled all over the world. Froelich the same. These guys know what they're doing. Frolic uh, inspired into sports early in life by his mother. At the age of five, he was swimming, gymnastics, track and field. Look, the moves. These guys are fast. Don't turn away from the screen. You'll miss something. They're loving it. Fans are loving it here. Kaniski, you watch him. <laughs> Your referee, Bob Steele from Yarmouth, Nova Scotia. He celebrated his birthday here a couple weeks ago in All Star Wrestling. 84. No. Apparently he's 52. Your referee is about 52 years old. Frolic, fast moves, head scissors. Scissors on by uh, the one and only Gene Kaniski in the early moments of this match. I hope we can get to talk to Gene Kaniski after this match. We're going to try and get him over here. Okay, it's a rare treat. In red is Eric Frolick in blue, Gene Kaniski. In the early moments of this match. You're going to be treated to a tag team match between um, Dean Ho and Klondike Mike, the current tag team champions, and they're going to go up against Mike Allen and Rocky Della Serra. So that's coming right up. I want to thank all the fans, All Star Wrestling, for writing to us and uh, the letters and cards and uh, Christmas wishes and uh, Happy New Year's. Uh, we appreciate it. We passed on all the mail to the wrestlers. And thank you for the personal ones for me. Nice! Hip toss and the scissors. This guy's fast. Blind eye. Mike, watch what's going on here. These guys are fast. Bondike Mike will be teaming up with Dino right after. And these guys are having a good match here. Headlocked by Gene Kaniski. A lot of action moves there. Flying head scissors. Lots of action. The fans love it. We have in our audience, and I hope we get a chance to talk to them, some soccer champs who happen to be visiting All-Star Wrestling, and uh, maybe we'll get to talk to these guys. Professional sports they are. Watching professional wrestling here. This is the first time, and they're loving it. They're loving it. Come on. Three minutes into this match. Yeah. Trophies of winning All-Star Wrestling is the bell, but the trophies in soccer is to own trophies. And I'll tell you in wrestling, those belts are important. They're the guys and a quick hello to you. They're pretty happy. They're also winners. They got the trophies, but in the ring are the winners. And when they go for the marbles, it's the belts, and they're important. I'll tell you. Gene Kaniski has wrestled all over the world, taking on Eric Froelich, and it's a foot headlock on him. And the pressure is being applied by Gene Kaniski. 
Gene's doing a great job here on the Frolic. Frolic watches every single move, and if there's ever a slip or anything, then he takes advantage. Kaneski's a pro. He knows. He's ready for anything. Gene's hair is short. You can't pull his hair, and that could be one of the reasons why Gene does keep short hair. Frolic has had the hair pulled a little bit, and unfortunately, uh, Bob Steele's not catching everything just to help Frolic, but Frolic does not really need help. How are you, So far, Frolic holding his own, but the edge is on Kaniski. Kaniski's strong. Five minutes into this first match, many matches in this 60 minute period. All the hair. Frolic brought back into a headlock. Kaniski against the ropes. And a big push and a shove. Look out. Back to the headlock again into the ropes. Whoa. Somebody got it. Somebody got it. It hurt. Checking for blood. Frolic holding the knee. And a kick to the head by Kaniski. You're watching All Star Wrestling. It comes to you every single week on this station right across Canada and the United States. Professional wrestling at its best. You're watching it right now. Kaniski's 265 pounds right rubbing on that head. And a kick. Oh, right in the kidney. You're going to be tough to be in the ring with Kaniski. Right to the old bread basket. This, oh, Kaniski's bleeding. Kaniski's bleeding. Kaniski doesn't stop. He's wrestling. And he hasn't stopped. Whoa. This guy is wild. here that knee must have really clouded him blood all over this not slowing down gene kaniski but he's hurt but he's a big man it, it must be just too much but he's in there hasn't stopped has not slowed down frolic right out of the ring hits the cement this guy came he, he really hit hard on that cement At the moment, we're all watching Frolic having problems with the answer to count. Whoa, this guy's taking it. For seven minutes into this match, and there's blood. It must have been a heavy hit. This is a tough guy. He's going and working it. Most exciting match here. Whoa, wow. They're going, the fans love it. Our first match, it just you ain't seen nothing yet. Pulling hair and counting by uh, Steele. Fingers right to the windpipe. Oh, and a kick and an arm and his leg. Everything's happening here. And don't miss anything. Frolic quick to react and miss. Turning around, Gene turning around, just finding out where he is. This guy's fast. Exciting match. Yeah, I hope you're not missing anything. Gene Kaniski against Eric Frolic. Kaniski wrestled everybody. He knows what to do. Frolic really handling himself well in this match. 
Too much for Kaniski. It's official. Jane Kaniski takes it. All right. Okay. Let's get, take a minute here. We've got a make room for Mr. Wrestler. Jane, you should have stopped for a break. It's an awful match there, an awful hit, but you did it. On the contrary, I have to give Eric Foley a great deal of credit. The man is just a super individual, a great wrestler, rough, tough, and rugged, and that's what I needed to motivate myself. As you know, the 28th, my son is to team up against um, this guy Adonis and Art Cruz. And he'll probably look at the split eye and a bit of a shiner. I can assure you folks, it's nothing. Very, very elementary, just a minor little scratch, a minor bit of swelling. Actually, the injuries that bother one is when you have those ligaments and tendons and those vertebrae misplaced, the neck injuries, back injuries, shoulders, knees, ankles, you can tape up. A little a superficial injury like this is a very minor man. You're, Gene, you're a tough guy. Most guys would have said, hey, that's it. That's it. I would, for a little scratch. Not for you. Heck, I wouldn't even bother putting a Band-Aid on. Uh, you sure? Heck no, with expense uh, uh, going up the way that I just couldn't afford to do it. I must apologize to all my uh, wrestling fans for the, uh, my appearance, uh, but when you're in a hazard sport such as professional wrestling, uh, one of is not able to control what is going to happen to his body. And speaking of body, as you know, John, my body is the Lord's temple. I am to protect it. I was a little stunned there. I was a little uh, groggy. I think Frohlich like, thought he had me in the way. He got me with a beautiful knee and a good forearm. Yeah, well, after I'd been uh, I'd sort of dazed a little bit, at all times I knew exactly what I was doing. I didn't have to go the ropes. I fully became a little anxious. He started coming on me a little strong. And uh, what I did, I started feeling uh, like uh, I was a little uh, more uh, 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 semi-conscious than I really was. And then I uh, he nailed me a couple of shots, and I said to him, Froelich, can't you hit any harder? And I think that really jarred him. And then all of a sudden, he went to go on me again. He made a mistake, and as a result, one, two, three, and again, my hand was raised in token of victory. Well, he come, got you come. upset. He got you upset, and you oh, came back. On the contrary, I would have it's to say this. a pretty bad mark there. It is not, you're, you're compounding things. It's not nothing. It's a minor scratch, abrasion. I have to say this, in all fairness to Eric Froelich, if I had to work out with any individual in the wrestling world, it'd be Eric Foley. This man is a tremendous athlete. He moves well. He is gutty. He has never complained. I need matches like that to stimulate and motivate me. And I can say this to all the fans who watch him now. Thank you, Mr. Eric Foley. I needed that slap in the face to get me back in the groove because my philosophy of life has not changed. Do unto others before others do unto you. It works very nicely. You know, I'd have sooner happened, uh, this happened to Eric Foley to myself. Now, John, I think we're running out of time. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank my fellow Canadians and the American viewing audience for allowing me in the homes via TV. And Kelly, my son, and I will see you Monday at 28th the Gardens when we go against Cruz and Adonis. John, I know there's a I thousand know. questions on your mind, exciting. so just go ahead and I'll tell you away. one thing. I'm glad I'm at this desk and that you go into the ring. We'll be back with more exciting all-star wrestling in just a few moments. Take care of that now. For what? There's nothing to matter.